First Quality Courier of Georgia is a woman-owned professional courier company since 1990. They provide courier services, light load freight, and private shredding within the metro Atlanta area and a few select counties. Give them a call at 678-414-8430. Ask for Kim and tell them C. Henry Adams sent you. Thanks. B-I-E-M-G Blogs discuss business development and the economy. It also talks about marketing, information technology, and telecommunications. Plus, it shares the commentary of C. Henry Adams presenting ordinary people who do extraordinary things. Hi, I'm C. Henry Adams. On Friday, December the 23rd, 2016, I spoke by phone with my pastor and first cousin, Reverend and Dr. C.O. Adams Jr., leader of Christ Community Praise and Worship Center, a ministry of the AME Church located in Clarkston, Georgia. He told me after a brief conversation that one of the young members by the name of Matthew Kraft, who happens to be a father, husband, small businessman, and inspiring minister, was in critical condition with triple pneumonia. He stated that when he responded to the situation and arrived at the hospital, some individuals were preparing for his death. But Pastor Adams, Lorinda, the wife of Matthew Kraft, members of the family, friends, and myself saw it differently. For we all believe in the power of prayer. In a recent conversation with Pastor Adams, he recalls that day Matthew Kraft took ill. The man led me to pray for him because I know the craft changes things. But I knew that it was in God, hey, all sickness was not unto death. So I prayed. Confident in Matthew's healing and recovery through God, Lorinda, his wife, tells the story. When I first found out about my husband and how, how bad it was, um, I was in a bad place at the time, but I, I held it together. Um, I had to call the family and friends. Um, it was the hardest thing I think I ever had to do to let them know how bad he was, but it was never no doubt in my mind or my body or my soul that he was all right or going to be all right, but I just didn't know the outcome of what he was facing, the consequences of what had happened. It was hard. I had to call mother to father, and then when I get ready to call his, his, uh, the pastor and let him know, um, it was just a, a hard thing. Can nobody believe that Matt was in the hospital and how bad it was because a lot of people had just seen him, just talked to him, just worked with him, etc. Mom, dad, pastor, everybody had just talked to him, so they didn't know what to expect. They didn't know how bad it was and what was going to come from it. And the same thing with me, but I had my confirmation early that he was going to be all right, that God had done healed him. He had done healed him, and that Matt had don't ask for the blessing that he need on the way to the hospital. It was the hardest thing because I didn't get to see him before they put him under, but God kept... Prayer changes things, and this was witnessed by Matthew Kraft through his experience. God gave me the chance to hear every prayer that was prayed. I didn't see nobody's faces. I heard all the voices. There were so many voices in my ears that it was unbelievable that I couldn't understand what all this talk was coming from. It was in my left ear, in my right ear, and as soon as I came to, I told the pastor what he had on without even seeing what he had on. And it was amazing how I knew detail of what he wore from the vision of God had showed me. And by God being who he is, he showed me who I am and what I'm supposed to do. Prayer changes things. The Matthew Craft story. Well, these are my thoughts. What say you? Thanks for reading, viewing, and listening to B-I-E-M-G Blogs. I'm C. Henry Adams, your commentator. This production of B-I-E-M-G Blogs was brought to you by First Quality Courier of Georgia. Call 678-414-8430. Executive Producer C. Henry Adams. Music composed, written, and copyright owned by Jay Berlinski. B-I-E-M-G Blogs is a 2017 copyright of B-I-E Media Group. LLC.